Sweat v. Painter, 1950. In 1946, Heman Marion Sweat was refused admission to the law school at the University of Texas at Austin on the grounds that it violated the Texas Constitution prohibition against integrating education. The state of Texas had no law schools designated for African Americans. Sweat sued in state court on the grounds that his equal protection rights under the 14th Amendment were violated. During the case, the state of Texas established a new law school at the Texas State University for Negroes in Houston. Regardless, Sweat continued his lawsuit all the way to the U.S. Supreme Court. In a unanimous decision, the Supreme Court ruled that the scheme to create a new black law school did not conform to the, quote, separate but equal, unquote, standard of the Plessy v. Ferguson ruling of 1896. The court ruled that the white law school was far superior in the number of faculty, facilities, and professional affiliations than did the newly created black school. Thus, the two law schools were not equal. This case laid the groundwork for the Brown v. Board of Education ruling in 1954.